this video we are going to talk about the right photos that you can take with your photo pass. And we're going to show you where the cameras are exactly so that you can prepare for the best fun pic you can ever imagine. So we are going to tell you in which attractions they are available and where exactly those pictures are taken. Come on! So we start off with Big Thunder Mountain and Buzz Lightyear's Laser Blast. And then there's also a photo opportunity in the beautiful Pirates of the Caribbean. And also if you'd like to have more of a spectacular ride, you can also have a photo taken in Rock and Roller Coaster. And last but not least, Star Wars Hyperspace Mountain. And the Tower of Terror, of course, with a spectacular drop. So these were the rides where you can have your uh, photo taken. Let's go over there and show you guys where that photo is actually being taken. Attention Space Rangers, your space cruisers have been temporarily halted. Please remain seated and set on the display. And I went from 200 points to 51,000. Now stand by for action because this is where the <clears throat> photo is being taken. So over here, just behind his legs, there should be the camera. Yeah. Well, we'll see what the result will be. Oh, price shooting, price shooting. We stopped again. So final scores. Level 3, where both are. Normally we have a higher score, but then we don't use the camera, so we have yeah. all the focus on shooting. We the are target. much better. Normally we're not we're much better. It's just that you guys are watching us. Good job, Space Rangers. And now we're gonna find out who points us in the right, right direction. <laughs> Elise looks straight into the camera. You were right. I found it. <laughs> Yay. So it was true. It was between uh, just yeah. just under the leg of Zerg. Yeah, I really have to look in the back, and there there's a, a black box with a shiny, yeah, like a piece of glass in it. I think and that's when I knew. Oh yeah, that's where the uh, camera is hidden. So uh, yeah, cool. Cool. We got it. now near Big Thunder Mountain and this is also one of those rides that has a photo taken inside the attraction. When you leave the tunnel from underneath the water and you go up the hill, uh, one of the first drops when you pass Phantom Manor, uh, that's where the right photo is taken. At the lowest point downhill, uh, it's on your left hand side. We know exactly when this photo is being made because Sven tells me when that moment it takes place because <laughs> I always forget when I'm inside a ride I am like oh this is amazing let's and enjoy then, the ride and yeah, that's a good thing yeah and then Sven says photo photo <laughs> sometimes we also prepare what we are going to do uh, when when the photo is taken uh, but most of the time it's just spontaneous And here you can get a preview of your photos. It is uh, a photo that's been taken outside. Here at Big, Big Thunder Mountain you can see was it winter time, was it summer? Yeah. Um, uh, is it at night, is it at day? Yeah, these moments are really fun. Yeah, uh, Because absolutely. you get a very good um, fragment of your time here in Disneyland Paris. Yeah, and uh, we've done this ride several times and you really can see the difference in the lighting uh, uh, if it's sunny or uh, if it's at night, uh, then you yeah. really can see a little bit of the flash that they use. All in all, great photo opportunity. Next ride on the list is Rock and Roller Coaster. A thrill ride that keeps you anticipating because of a countdown before launch. The photo is taken directly after the launch. So next time you're in one of these cards, get ready. We can conclude that the, that the camera is actually more up. We were looking like, we were sitting and we were looking like this. But we had to look like this. That's our conclusion. Right? Yeah, absolutely. Here we are at the Tower of Terror. And we are here because there's also a photo opportunity in this ride. We only know that it's in front of you. And uh, well, the ride is so spectacular that we 
cannot focus on to find out where the camera exactly is and when the photo is actually taken. When you are in this ride, you are so overwhelmed by all the action. Uh, we don't want to spoil too much. Maybe you've already done this ride and you know exactly what we're talking about, but it's like, oh, what is what is going on? What is, what is happening? And um, we tried to look around us, try to see where the camera is exactly, but the only thing I was thinking about was, how do I get out of this ride as soon as possible? So, um, I'm sorry guys, we don't know exactly when it's taking place, probably after the first drop, or, or during the first drop actually, but it's right in front of you, so try to smile, <laughs> it's, it's already a big challenge, <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, this is uh, the case with this um, ride. Yeah, it's, it's the most difficult one to get a, a special pose with your friends or family, so uh, well, just enjoy the ride, it's fun. One of the other rides that has a photo taken while you're in the ride itself is Pirates, Pirates, of, the Pirates, Pirates of the Caribbean. Caribbean. The photo is taken at the moment of the second drop in the ride. So first you yeah. go up, first drop, no photo. Second drop, photo. <laughs> Very well <laughs> explained. First no, second kiss. <laughs> but uh, so uh, to give you an idea of where the second drop is, it's after the big scene with all the fire. With all the fire and the pirates looting and plundering the town. Yes. Uh, so uh, this gives you an idea of when to be ready for that, uh, that photo uh, in your ride. But to find the right angle for the camera, it was quite a task. So Elise, was I right with pointing out the camera? No, you're absolutely wrong. Right. <laughs> oh boy. We've got it, but we have to do this ride again, unfortunately. And point out the camera. Here we go for a second turn. And it's only a five minute wait, so we are very happy. <laughs> Those magic five minutes that you always love so much. <laughs> oh, 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 it's haunted. Oh, pirates, be warned. King. Of the boat, king of the boat. Yes, <laughs> we've got the whole, whole boat to, to ourselves. ourselves. We, we got, got the whole big boat, boat. To, to ourselves. We got the whole boat to ourselves. We got the whole boat to ourselves. found the right angle we looked a bit too much to the right we should have looked a little bit more up to the front so not that's too right. the right but a little bit more to the front yeah. then you have the perfect angle for this picture what makes this ride so fun to take your to have your photo taken well, you can think about how you want to go on the photo how you what the pose is you know after which scene the drop is going to take place and we tried several things um, of course you always have to be careful not to block the view of people behind you so hands up for example is not a good idea not a good yeah, idea you get some very grumpy people behind you when you're previewing your photos so for some people this is the only ride they are going to take because maybe they are they are in Disneyland Paris for only one day and then their photo was ruined because of your hands yeah nobody wants that right so if you must put your hands up ask for a seat in the back yeah, that's a good idea. Another ride where photos are taken is here in Hyperspace Mountain. It's a really uh, fun photo because you can pose for it. And that's because the photo is taken before the ride takes place, if that makes sense. So before you get the launch, you already get your picture taken. So the right photo for Hyperspace Mountain will be taken just when you leave the boarding station. So here you go, into the tunnel. Through the corners, down here, that's where your photo gets taken. And then you get prepared to be launched into the cannon.
it would have been different if the photo opportunity would have been exactly when you are launched and everybody would be thrilled and the picture would be entirely different but unfortunately that's not the case but it's also a benefit because yeah you can pose for this picture and create a picture that maybe you had in mind all along just and like we did the other time with our map of Disneyland Paris so, so is the PhotoPass Plus worth the 99 euros? well it could be because if you buy one right photo, which is 20 by 25 centimeters, including frame, it's 25 euros. So four photos, and you got more than five uh, attractions with a photo, it's cheaper already. If you take the cheapest option of the photos, which is a photo of, uh, which is nine by six centimeters, it's 17 euros per photo. Even then, it's uh, cheaper to get the PhotoPass Plus. Uh, then buying all the small photos uh, uh, separately. If you take into account that all the photo pass photographers, all the photos are included as well, then you really got a good deal on the photos here in Disneyland Paris. Well, with all this information that we gave you today in this video, you will have the best pictures taken in the ride. I think from everybody in this land Paris. And if you have a special photo taken with our tips, please share it with us on social media. You know where to find us. Um, you can share your picture with us by um, tagging us in your um, message, and then we can read it and it just like your, your photo as well. So that would be awesome. Maybe next time we'll see, see you in Main Street. Street. Bye! King of the boat, we, we got, got the holy boat. boat. To Try sell. <laughs> Okay, that was a mixture of the Tim Tracker and Justin's card, all in one. Perfect job. <laughs> yeah? Oh, <laughs> pirates. <laughs> hey guys, uh, thank you for watching our video from Sealy Main Street. And you can watch more videos if you click over here. And if you haven't subscribed, you really should do it because if you do, you will make sure that Jack Sparrow will find his black pearl and he will sail the seven seas. So subscribe to our channel over here and maybe next time we'll see you on Main Street.